right here. Section B, row 17. So we're this way. You think you're gonna be able to play like this? Hmm? <laughs> we're here, section B. We got 13, 14, 15, 16. Go down, let me get on it. Yeah. It's in there, you just gotta go down, dig deep again. It. It's in there, you gotta play like You gotta dig down in there deep and pull it out tonight. It's in there. It's in there. You gotta dig down deep and pull it out. Burst, come on. Hey, be great. Hey, be great today. Don't be that dude now. Come on, Pat. Come on, dog. Hey, big plays out you now. Hey, you showed up for four. Hey, you showed up for four. Can you do it for five? Can you do it for five? Can you do it for five? You got me? Hey, hey, be us. Hey, you ain't got to do anything different. You ain't got to do anything different. Be you. You're good, you're good enough. Hey, I can't wait to see y'all play. I love you, boys. Hey, let's go. I'm out the circle. Hey, let's go. Playmakers out three. One, two, three. Playmakers. Hey, it's money time. It's going to be real short and sweet. First night game, New Vault Hemingway Stadium. A standard needs to be set. You get 12 opportunities in the course of a season that you work year round for. Please don't waste one. Please don't waste one. You don't win a game like this with people that are close to you by running your mouth. That's not how you win it. You win it with that headgear, with them pads, with taking care of the ball, with going to get the ball, doing your assignment with great enthusiasm for 60 minutes. Send a message. Let's go. Go. The youngsters of those that lost their lives led the team on the field just moments ago and they're along the sidelines, Richard, and that's pretty doggone cool. It's, uh, it's been really special in a way to, to see the way the Oxford community has wrapped its round, uh, arms around those three families. Let's play some football. Here's the opening kickoff, Ole Miss and Memphis from Oxford. This is a feisty Memphis team coming in that can score on anybody and anywhere. There's the snap on third and two. Screen. There's the screen and it's blown up by Ole Miss. The safety, Zedrick Woods, and it's fourth down. Let's go, it's time to go. It's time to go, oh, let's go, baby. Let's go. All right, go, all three, you go. There's a snap, he's going to hand off to Judd, sweeping left, he's got a chance, he's in the five, two, one. Did he break the plane or no? They say out of bounds at the half yard line. Right there, right there. Keep it. Using the stiff arm. Touchdown, Rebels. He was in trouble in the backfield, but found a way to get free and dove into the end zone. Touchdown, Ole Miss. A minute 10 to go in the first quarter. Ole Miss leads 7 0. Gun formation. There's the snap. Play action pass. Near side. Picked off by Woods. Woods is taking it to the house. Touchdown, Ole Miss. Dedrick Woods jumped the route. Yes, sir. Yeah, in that play, we're in uh, one of our 3-4 looks where Marquise is kind of a stand-up linebacker coming off the edge. And he ran right at the mesh point, put the quarterback in a hurry. Obviously, the guy hadn't even turned around yet, and, and Zedrick had a great eye on it and came right to him. I don't think he was expecting it, and Woods picked it clean as a whistle and got six. And for the second consecutive game, Ole Miss gets a touchdown from that land shark defense. Let's go! We up in this thing all day! Two big sixes, two weeks. Turn up, man! Pressure from Haynes on third down. Ball is loose. Scooped up by Ole Miss. We talk about every time you get to the quarterback to make sure you get the ball out. And, uh, and he did that. And, and Tomahawked right on the quarterback's hand, knocked the ball, and then DJ wrapped right into it and it bounced right up into his, his hands. And it was pretty awesome to see two D linemen in on the play. Let's go, oh, punch it in. There's the snap. He fakes to Buford. Turns, going to bootleg, trying to get there on his own, and he gets in the end zone. Touchdown, Jason Ellerin for the six. I saw a land. Hey, Greg. That was a huge block. Mm. Ole Miss 24, Memphis 7 at the break. You're playing a good football team that is explosive and can score a lot of points. 
you have to lock in for 60 minutes. you got 30 more minutes to go and outplay them with heart, desire, physicality, passion, taking care of the ball, offense, defense, keep go getting the ball. you got to go send a message. It's 60 minutes tonight, nothing else. 60 minutes. We play the next 30 better than we played the first 30. Finish this thing. Rise up. One, two, three. Rise up. Hand off to Judd, left side. He's got some room. He's a 50 to the 45. Breaks the tackle on the near sideline. Go, boy, go, boy. Go, boy. Go, boy. Has a blocker in front. He's at the 25 to the 20. 15, 10, 5. Touchdown. Oh, miss. And now, whoop. They're saying he stepped, stepped out on the out three. Oh, my goodness. Oh, wow. Oh, they called him out right at the one. We got two more. We got two quarters, man. Play next play. Come on, Judd. Come on. Facing another fourth down, one play would bring the Tiger offense roaring back to life. Smith, and now they're going to dump it underneath on a fake, and it's caught, breaking a tackle up to 30 to 35, and out of bounds on the near sidelines around the 40. That was brilliant execution. I'm not sure if I've ever seen a fake punt like that. Ferguson rolling to his right, stops, throws downfield, open receiver, and it's caught. Anthony Miller inside the 20. Now the handoff straight ahead to the end zone. Touchdown, Dorcias and Memphis with a gutsy call on a fourth down punting situation. Went for it, got it, and then boom, boom, touchdown for the Tigers. Wilson plays in the seventh quarter. Hey, we are keep playing, dog. We just gave up a touchdown. That was a free touchdown. That can't happen. Again, going quickly. And Ferguson waltzes into the end zone. Everybody went for Dorcius. Ferguson kept it, and Memphis within a score. You know, as a defensive coach, you really don't like when those things happen. And um, you look up at the scoreboard, all of a sudden it's a one-score game in the third quarter. And that was the exact same thing that happened last year. You know, we won't worry. We already knew we, how fast our offense can score. So, you know, Chad got us, you know, composed and told us, you know, let's go down there and score quick. Rolled on the sleep and found number 17, Evan Ingram with the TD, his fourth of the year. And while the offense was firing through the air, ultimately the ground game would tame the Tigers in the fourth quarter. There's the snap, handoffs to Brazlett, he's working to the left, hesitated for a moment, lowers his head, dives for the pylon, touchdown, Oh Miss! That's the way to do it! You know, most teams look at us as a passing team, and that shows that we also can run the ball as well. He's going to give it to Brassley. Brassley straight ahead. He's got room to the 20, the 15, the 10. He's going to get there to the 5. Diving into the end zone. Touchdown. Oh, miss. It's a Eugene Brassley night. I watched Antonio Brown, you know, point, and he said, always oh, he call guys, so I thought that was neat. You know, when he got it, I knew. He's going to score because he broke that hole. I was like, oh, he's going for a touchdown automatically. And it's over. Ole Miss 48, Memphis 28. The Rebels are 3-2 and two going into an open day. We got a lot of work to do. We got that win, but now it's time to get on this road with the SEC stuff, man. That was a big win. You know, I had to get that bad taste out of my mouth from last year. Yeah, we got this bye week coming up. Just got to get everybody back healthy, get ready to come back for some SEC play. But I want to tell you now, we, we've still got a long way to go. We still long make way. a lot of mistakes. But I want to tell you, that one meant a lot to me. And uh, there were some good things. We have some things we have to improve on in the open week if we want to make a run here after it's over. I'm real pleased. I thought our defense made uh, created turnovers, which was great for us. Still got a, a lot of improving to do on that side of the ball, particularly at linebacker. And, um, and, but offensively, we answered when we needed to. Good game, huh? Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Hold on, hold on. Yeah, I'm going to get a key to take it. Oh, what do y'all take it? Every year when the schedule comes out, I always look to see who we have an extra week to prepare for. And um, <clears throat> to get that extra week for Arkansas, a team who's going to pound us and, and present problems who we've had problems in the past defending. Um, I think we're really excited about that. And, and, uh, and to have some fun too, to get out there and have some fun with the guys, get back to work, and then not to be stressed out next Saturday. Sit down and watch other people stress while we're on our couch for a day will be fun.